I'm going to do a quick overview of the Monolink uh, PD300X and their Monolink software. I do apologize if I'm pronouncing the name wrong. Uh, my understanding is that it's pronounced like, uh, you know, stereo or mono and not Moana. But uh, again, I apologize if I got that wrong. Uh, I have their software hooked up. Uh, this Monolink does not work with the PD300X yet on Macintosh. Uh, they told me they would have that software out in January, so just stand by for that. Right now I'm on a Windows computer, and these are just the basic elements of uh, Monolink. Uh, right here I could start a recording. I'm recording this in OBS um, software so I can get uh, you know some screen capture going on here as well. Uh, microphone gain, uh, as I crank this up, I get louder and louder, and as I bring it back down, I'm trying to keep everything in the green and maybe just barely tickling the yellow over here. Uh, the headphone volume, I am wearing a pair of studio headphones, and, uh, you know, obviously I can increase the loudness in my headphones here. Uh, the monitor mixer... This splits up, um, it says the monitor mixer is used to tune the mixing ratio of microphone monitor and computer playback. So uh, right now I've just got it set all the way over to mic microphone. I will play around with this later. And noise gate, I believe, uh, it says here, uh, attenuates the signal below the threshold. So it's just dropping the floor noise. I think if I come back this way, yeah, I hear some hissing going on, and if I bring it back up this way, it drops the floor noise, uh, which is nice. And sometimes I was hearing myself tap the keyboard as well, too. Uh, the multiplex option for the mute key, this tells the, mute, the physical mute key on the microphone button what to do. Now we get into the scenes. Uh, you can uh, run original, which changes the sound. Uh, this is your podcasting uh, scene. I was running on just the straight recording because, you know, I'm not really podcasting right now. And this is uh, the scene where you're, you know, first person shooter fragging people and stuff like that. Uh, one of the things that I've noticed that the pros really like about this is that you can adjust your compressor, uh, which changes the dynamic range, and you can change your uh, limiter, which uh, keeps you from going over a predetermined setting. So this is pretty neat and pretty powerful software, and I just thought I'd just uh, run through it real quick, uh, not only for my audience, but for me as well, as I'm pretty new to this uh, studio microphone game. So that's that. Let's uh, call this one a day, put it in the books, and see you later.